Hi friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Designs. I'm back today with a um, Ranger mystery box. And all I've done is open it this way and kind of taken off the, the um, whoops, I dropped something, <laughs> and taken off the part of the label. So, all right, let me kind of wipe this off because, you know, our, our sweet post office, it, it, it's such a long thing. But anyway, so here's what it looks like. That's all I've seen is black paper. Let's see what's on the inside. So you open it up. I'll, I'll redo the, the table. Ooh, look. <gasps> Ooh, okay. <laughs> I have never used these. So hold on. Let me scoot this to the side so I can set everything out here with you guys. And I will now rewipe this off again. And let's get going. Okay, so I was sent this, and I'm really excited about this. So this is 10 five-color foiling sheets. Shiny transfer foil sheets. Works with Ranger adhesive sheets, strips, and sticky embossing powder. I'm excited. No uh, easy transfer, no heat or tools required. All right. Well, you know, I'll be looking up on YouTube somebody who demonstrates this. Hopefully, Ranger probably has a video. Okay. So, with it, they sent... Oh, neat. They sent me a Ranger bag. Oh, how cute is that? I have seen people with these bags and wonder where did they get them from super cute oh that's too much fun okay i love that i always can use bags matter of fact i was at a christian bookstore today um and um, our family has a tradition of wearing christian shirts for the fourth of july and i wanted to pick up um something special for my husband my youngest daughter and i um we're going to be on a trip and so anyways but um i looked at christian bags and so Anyways, they are not cheap, and I did not, I ended up getting a very inexpensive bag, so I could take it and put my Bible journaling things in it on the, on the trip, and it can't be too big because my back is out. So, anyways, but I love that bag. That's going to be fun, too. Um, let's see. So, the first thing, ooh, purple stickles. Let's see what color this is. This is, mm-mm-mm, has to be grape or something. Uh, it doesn't say what color. Hmm. That is very interesting. Well, oh, it's purple. <laughs> How easy was that? It's purple stickles. Super cute. And it's little. Um, here's also some, oh, distressed glitter. This is fun. If I have this already, that may go into one of the drawing boxes. So we'll see. Ooh, here is a glisten stickles. These are kind of the perfect size, like when you're doing your Bible journaling and you're traveling. So, I may take this with me. That'll be fun. Okay, because I think this video is going to come up later. And here is a full-size stickle. This is Ice Glace. Glace, Glace. Anyways, isn't that a pretty blue? And this is a full-size. All right. And then here is another full-size. And this one is Ice Gla Glace 2. Hmm. So, I'm wondering what the difference is in the colors. So, hold on. Maybe that's just what it is. It's a glitter glue. This is a glitter glue. So, I'm trying to find the color in this. I'm so sorry. I really need new glasses. If you can't, if you haven't noticed lately, if you're in my Bible study, you'll know I need new glasses. Um, hmm. I do not see the color. I am so sorry. But, here are these two. Maybe you guys can see the colors on it. Okay, so there are those two, and, ooh, another glitter, and this one is Brushed Corduroy, and this one was Stormy Sky. So fun, those are really fun. All right, now, ooh, I see more stickles. So here is another Tiny Stickles, and this is called Wonderland. I love that one. It's kind of iridescent with lots of different colors in it, but it has kind of a blue undertone, purple undertone. So there's those three. And then here is a full-size glitter glue, and this is kind of a gold color. And again, I just don't see the, the name of it on it. I'm so sorry. If I find the name of it, I will list it below. Um, okay, a little bit more. Goodness. Oh, here is another... Ooh, I love this color. This is mustard seed. I do not have that color. That is really pretty. I love that. So you can see it better. Let me see if I turn these upside down. You can see these probably better. Super fun. Okay, so there's those three. <gasps> Ooh, and I'm coming to the end of my box. But I am super excited. 
mica spray. So here's the Dina Weekly. This is Ruby. <clears throat> Isn't that pretty? I do not have that color. Love that. And I don't have any Dina Weekly. Um, and then I have a Dina Weekly. And this is Lapis. Isn't that gorgeous? I do not have that. And a spray. And this one is Pearl. Which I have to tell you, this could all go just straight in with a glue pen. Um, maybe my Nuvo glue, glue pen. I'm sure there's stuff with um, Ranger as well or embossing um, ink. And I this would be great in a Bible journaling kit. So how much fun is that? Or, you know, if you're just any of your projects, your card making, your anything that you're working on. So your junk journals, any of that. So super, super fun. Um, again, this was luck of the draw. You do not get to peek or pick. Sorry, peek too. Um, I didn't peek, but um, you, it's just luck of the draw. And uh, I just got an email and I thought, hey, why not? Let's just give it a little bit of a try. That would be fun. So, and then they also did throw in this cute little bag. So, all right, my friends, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, this was kind of a fun little haul. So, um, yeah, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Uh, I hope everything is going well for y'all. I am super excited. We're getting ready to have our summer Bible journaling adventure camp or summer adventure Bible journaling camp. And um, we're finishing off all the kits. I'll be coming back tomorrow, Lord willing, with a video. Um, my husband was supposed to print things out for me today. He just called me and he had to go back and print them out for me. But um, we'll hopefully get those all in the mail I'm praying tomorrow. I have through Wednesday to get them in the mail. If you are still interested, it is free. It is, uh, the kit is free. It has a signature. It'll have all sorts of um, encouragements in each one. You'll have ephemera. You'll have stickers. You'll have um, things to mark with. You'll have, um, you'll have your own um, Bible. The scripture will be included. And the only thing you're going to need is a pair of scissors and some type of adhesive, either a glue or a um, tape runner um, or even a glue stick. And um, what else did I think? I think that's about it. I mean, yeah, I think you can, with that alone, you'll be good to go. And a Bible would be great if you have one of those. And anybody who has a journaling Bible, I will also have a journaling Bible example each time, each day. It'll go from January, uh, pardon me, July 15th to August 15th and it will be daily and I will share my Bible journaling as well as my journaling in the signature. So um, anyways, if you're interested, email me at josephinesdesigns.com at gmail.com. I will be glad to send you a kit. They're going to begin going out tomorrow and again it is our Summer Adventure Bible Journaling Camp. So we have been blessed to have so many people support this channel. I am so excited to get back. All right, my dear sweet friends, um, like, subscribe, share. If you're not subscribed, can I ask you a question? Why not? Come on back. There's lots of good things here. Lots of encouragement. We'd love to have you. And as this channel continues to grow, I'm always amazed. Um, we have drawings. We have giveaways. We have um, a another big drawing coming at the 1200 member mark and then we'll have another one at the 1400 and I think at the 2000 is what I said. So um, anyways, come on back and then we also have fun drawings at the end of the video sometimes just for fun. All right, sweet friends, again I pray your day is blessed, creative, and lovely. I will be talking to y'all soon. Have a great day. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.